I told him, don't let me live this long. So if I make it this far, I'ma really be on there. I'ma hit the ground running. LeBron James style. <laughs> I told him. Hi guys. What do you think? I want keys. Give me keys. <laughs> Another canal find. Just going to run through some of these finds that will be on down here on the floor. A couple of weeks worth of finds. Run through these shotgun barrels. All this is in the video. You see me pulling it up. These are amazing. Absolutely amazing. Deactivated. But look as dangerous as they come. So I'll just give you a quick wrap up of the finds that are behind me. Please enjoy the video. I told him, don't let me live this long. So if I make it this far, I'ma really be on there. I'ma hit the ground running. LeBron James style. <laughs> I told him. Check it out though. Hi guys, magnet fishing again tonight. Somebody's been here, left a load of stuff there, but I just want to show you this. I told him. Yeah. Don't let me Shotgun live barrels. This been sealed off there. Well, it's shut. Really so you couldn't fire anything through that because it's I'm been sealed off. So why they're in there, I don't know, nobody can hide anything. It's, it's been a real shotgun at one time, but it's been sealed off. The rest of it. Hi guys, this is what I want to show you. <laughs> That. I couldn't believe it when I saw it. It's a spanner in the concrete. You see it? It's obviously when they've cast this concrete, somebody's lost a spanner in it and it's got cast into the concrete. Now as it's rusted through, it's started breaking through the concrete. How old that thing is, I haven't got a clue. <laughs> what a thing to see. Cast into concrete. Look just up there. You just see the light between the two carriageways north and south down. No spanner. I just thought I'd show you that. Thanks for watching, join me on the next find. Hi guys, just had that out. What on earth is that? I think it's some kind of car or truck related, some heater maybe or some kind of gear or something. If anybody knows what that might be, whack it in the comments below, because I'm interested. <laughs> Thanks for watching, jump on the next find. Hi guys, next batch of finds. This is a bit of a strange one. I don't think it's working anymore. It's some sort of stopwatch. It says boss on it. I haven't got a clue. broken. <laughs> this came out with it. I think that's just a piece of a tin can I think. Well, there you go. It's the first time I pulled one of them out, whatever that is. Stopwatch. So he's been running timing themselves. Thanks for watching. Join me in the next set of finds. Yeah guys here's just some of the finds. Huge plate. This strange object. Hampton and a few little odds and sods, but nothing to uh, oh, a spike. Nothing to set the heart racing. See these little bits that they leave it. That's been in the canal, you can tell. It's rusted through. Old bit of barbed wire. Why they leave them there, I don't know, but they do. Because they don't want to tidy up after themselves, so I'll pick them up if I see. Thanks for watching. Join me on the next find.
Hi guys, at the Cattell tonight, I'm trying a bit more magnet fishing, this grounds are still a bit rock hard for metal detecting. I'll show you some of these finds in a minute. You see where I am? <laughs> Canal's behind me. Uh, I'll just take you through some of these finds, a few little interesting bits have come up. I only thought I'd come out for an hour or so just to give it a try. But I'll show them you, hopefully I can get them in the light because I'm under a bridge and it's quite dark. But watch these finds. I told him, don't let me live this long, so I make it this far, I'ma really be on it, I'ma hit the ground running, LeBron James style, <laughs> I told him, check it out though. Hit the ground running, watch the gradios. Point me to the finish line, bitch. Adios. Season 20 after this, might have to just go ghost. No telling who been in there feels the most. Yeah, guys, just a little alcove in this bridge here. Yeah. CD ROM for a computer. Two massive, um, delight barge mooring spikes. You stick them in the ground, tie a rope round, starts your barge floating off. A strange thing there, one old English pants, and a piece of wire. And they're not coming from underneath the bridge, they're just a little bit ways out over there. Because I think this bridge has been done as most of them have been. So I'll keep filming, see if I can pull any more of this computer up. <laughs> Thanks for watching, join me on the next find. Hi guys, uh, sorry for the quality of this video. Uh, I came up tonight just. Um, just for half an hour basically, you're not going to believe what I pulled out again. <laughs> I'll show you this. I just won't pull it, but like a whole belt, a whole belt of them. All live. I don't know if anybody knows about these things. That's amazing. Absolutely amazing. Some of the clips broke off as it come up. I don't know what size these are. See the belt. That's amazing. Crazy amazing. Right. <laughs> what to do with them? Who knows? It's gonna be another trip to the police, I think. Unbelievable. Thanks for watching. Jump in the next hole. Hi guys, these are finds to, uh, they look a bit more, well they are dangerous I suppose, but they're for keeping boats, you'd knock them into the grass, like that. And you tie your boat to it, just two of them. The shotgun barrels that you've just seen at the start, totally deactivated. Not dangerous at all. The worst thing you could do with these is probably drop them on your toe. <laughs> probably do more damage. See how somebody's cut them out here. If you tried to fire them, that'd just <laughs> take your hand off probably. <laughs> and the they've been welded up at the front. Why somebody would chuck a deactivated shotgun barrel into the canal? I have no idea. I know that's an awesome find. Awesome find. It's probably one of my best finds yet to date. That is. Right onto these, a few little your usual canal crap that you get. Part of an engine, I've got that from underneath the M6. Uh, that's good. Double lock key. They're worth money, then, man. I clean that up. Don't know how much you get for that. I'll probably get a 10 or so, 15 quid for that. Pays for the magnet. These look like Chinaman's hats, but they're. Um, if you've ever seen a barge, it sits on top of the smokestack, like a top of a chimney. Don't know how old they are. See, quite old. Here's another one. Look at the frisbee. Piece of this. Big ball. Hinge. Part of a bicycle brake. I think the rest of the bike's down there, but I couldn't pull it out. 
got that last one, mate. Fork. Fucking hell. It's a fork. <laughs> Top boots. This is nice. An old. I don't know what I don't know if it's a I think it's a chisel. Woodworker's chisel. I thought it was a file when I first found it, but it's a chisel. A bit blunt now, you're not really gonna chisel much away with it. A floppy disk drive to a computer. Why somebody chuck that in? Well, who knows? And all. I got this as well last night. Am I? That'll come in handy for something. Smash that up. <laughs> then that. Just a quick roundup of some of the better finds. I've got a bucket load of stuff there, but. It's just crap, basically. Bits of because I've left it out. Spam tins, bolts, scaffolding stand things. So that's been it. I say, that's a cool find. Makes for a good video. Uh, there is some bullets in this video that I haven't got. You'll see in this video. <laughs> like a, a machine gun belt of bullets. Like again, I don't know what they're doing in there, why somebody would throw them in there, but they have done. You'll see that in the video. Uh, so, all I have to say is thanks again for watching. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe at the bottom. Um, um, a previous video will come up at the top here. The last magnet fishing video I'll put up at the top here. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. So, thanks for watching and join me on the next hunt.